News for Midday starts now. And the key to the perfect pasta dish, you cook it, I'll eat it. We are <laughs> cooking the favorite today in honor of National Pasta Month and showing the secrets to keeping it healthy. Food, speaking of food, October's National Pasta Month, and believe it or not, Americans eat approximately 20 pounds of pasta every year. In parts of Italy, the number is even bigger. The average person eats about 51 pounds of pasta. Yum. Chef Ford Barsi from Carmine's is here with a look at why pasta, it, pasta is so popular. It's nice to have you and to have this, and I wish those who are watching yes. could smell what we smell. Oh, I know. It's fantastic. So, so we know pasta is, is popular because it's good. Uh, but, but is it because the pasta is so versatile? Is that what really makes yeah, it so popular? Yeah, you know popular? what? I think it is. It's kind of it's kind of like rice in a way that you can put whatever kind of flavors and yeah. sauce with it that you want, and it absorbs it. So any kind of taste or kind of kind of you know preference can have pasta and be, be great. Yeah, and pasta doesn't have to ruin your diet. You know, that's right. And, and kind of what I want to showcase now is what Carmine's does best. It's not only that you can come in with the family and have any kind of particular taste and find your own pasta, but any type of dietary restriction or preference we can do as well. I brought some a sample for you guys of what we can offer. Okay. Um, I've got a vegetarian pasta, which is a penny with the tomato cream sauce. Mm -hmm. um, I have a vegan pasta, which is just fresh plum tomato sauteed that's, over that's a whole wheat pasta. Mm -hmm. um, and I've got your classic meatballs in front for anyone that just wants to go all out, just like you probably should at Carmine's. The meat lovers. Um, and then what I've had simmering here is my favorite pasta which is our mixed seafood which has lobster clams mussels shrimp and calamari Ooh. and I've got on the side here a gluten-free pasta made from corn that we offer which is my favorite yeah so what's really cool is that you can have the whole family and pick and choose and get a few dishes to share but do not worry about if you have a gluten pre preference yeah. or a dietary restriction come on we're familiar we even have our own gluten-free and allergy menu that's a separate from the regular menu you know people would, would think you can't eat gluten-free and you can't eat uh, you know a low calorie meal at, a, at an Italian restaurant no, yeah, and, and, and it's not true. And, it's and, not and true. We, we really make it a point to, to make sure that any kind of person with any kind of taste or preference can come and have a great time. Mm -hmm. And you mentioned the menu, so I just, we can't read it, but what you have here is a menu that is specifically for people with certain kinds of allergies. It's, really, it's really awesome. It really goes into detail. If you have a wheat or a gluten preference or an allergy, it has a whole page which explains what you can and cannot have. Um, dairy, garlic, nuts, all that kind of stuff, you are taken care of when you come to Carmine's. Is there a, a trick to preparing gluten-free pasta? Because I've cooked mine a little too much. And, I'm just going to pour this over while you're going. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's nice and hot. The trick to gluten free Look pasta this, is. It's beautiful. You know, it, just, just like with any other pasta, make sure there's enough water, that it's seasoned right. You don't want the t pasta to taste bland. Even though you season the sauce, make sure you season the water that the pasta is cooking in as well. Mm -hmm. um, the other thing is, you want it to put it in the sauce right when it's ready. You don't want it to sit. Ah. It can become soggy, gluten-free pasta. You okay. want it right when it's done, get the sauce on and serve it okay. immediately. That's, that's, that's my advice. All right, well, you're going to fix a, a little plate right, for I'm me to fix taste plate. here. Yes, you exactly. taste it. Now, I understand you have a special, some special events coming up this week. Give me one that I, doesn't require a cracking. There you go. All right, there it okay. is. Okay, yeah. Uh, you got something special happening? Um, yes, my wife and I are having a baby. I actually do this Thursday. Hi. Oh. Congratulations. So I could get the call any minute now. All righty. Well, thank Go you for on. taking time to come and um, give us a little taste of this. So yes, I'm going to taste it, uh, and I'll bring you some millet. He's still... That's Chef Ford Barcy of Carmine's in Pan Quarter. Oh, my goodness. It smells so good in here. Thank you. Oh.